Hey y'all, another day, another haul. Today is all about Zara. Y'all can see my big bag here. And total cost of this haul is £304. In Naira, that is about 365,000 Naira. But don't start calculating because I did not get all of these at once. I've been piling up for this haul. I got some things that I got to the UK and I got some things from Nigeria, right? For those who are seeing me for the first time, hi, my name is Chantel. Thank you so much for joining today. If you like what you see, please do also subscribe. Also, don't forget to turn on that bell icon next to the subscribe button. So whenever I post, you'll be one of the first to get my notification. I don't want to bore you too much with my intro. Let's just get into the haul proper. Alrighty, see ya. And this is this mid-length dress in cotton fabric. I really like the print. I feel like I'm gravitating towards green so much these days. I don't know why. I can't even explain why, but this is what the dress looks like. It's a tiered dress, would I call it? Yeah, it has two tiers, here and here. And this is in a double XL. For those who don't know, Zara sizing is very, very limited. I feel like if I get past this size I am now, I don't think I'll be wearing anything Zara again. That's how limited their sizing is. But yeah, I love the fit of it on me. This is giving me mom errands, like if I'm running after my kids or on days when I'm not in the mood to dress up, but I still want to look cute. Last year when I went to Dubai, I saw a lady in this dress, but another print, the one they released last year, and it looked so cute on her. So when I saw it in the store, I'm like, okay, I need to have it. I need to get it. I don't know if I'm going to be keeping it because of how snug the arms are and the boobs area, but it's actually a very cute style. Coming closer, you can see how cute the print is. It has no room. There's no stretch. You can see the gap around my boobs area. It's not free at all. But if I wear a less padded bra, I think it will work very well. So this is what it looks like. This is what the back looks like. This I got for $49.95. Just call it £50. Yeah, this is what it looks like. Downside for me is that it doesn't have pockets. I would want something that I can just slip my hands into. But this doesn't have that. If you're looking to get it, get it in your perfect size. Don't size down or size up because it has an oversized fit around from the waist down. This is a very free dress nothing much to eat if you want to cinch your waist you can use a belt but i think i will um just wear it like this on days when i just want to feel very free and casual next on my list is this cohort set in remy fabric remy fabric is an eco-friendly fabric and it doesn't emit a lot of things that the environment doesn't need in simple terms i love 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 this Against my skin tone is bay. I love the tie-dye print. Consists of a lot of greens in different shades. I love the pants. It's free. This is in double XL. No, the top is in XL and the pants is in double XL. Because I couldn't find double XL for the top. Hence the snug fit on the arms. You all know that my arms are big, but I love the fit of this on me. It's giving rich girl. It's giving I pay my bills. I don't need no one. <laughs> I already have a way to style this with my green Jimmy Choo nails. It would be amazing. And my bag, it looks so awesome. I'm thinking of keeping this. The pant has a drawstring on it so you can let it loose or tie it and snatch your waist even more. <clears throat> like i'm doing here i also love the fact that it has pockets the length on me is perfect as well the top amazing it's colorless you can stack up your jewelry and it looks so good this is what the back looks like right yeah yo let me know what you think about this should i keep or return let me know in the comment section because your decision is fine now for me so if you tell me to keep it yes i'll keep it if not I'm a return it, but yeah, I really like this thing. I love, love, love it. I can wear it to church. I think I'm going to keep it. Don't bother. Don't bother booting. <laughs> keep it. I really like it. Top is 50 pounds, pants is 50 pounds. So in total, 100 pounds for this. That's quite expensive though. Looking at it from the Nigerian um, perspective. I had to pair the next items just to get a look because I don't have a top for this and I don't have pants for this, all right? I got the top in Nigeria and I got the pants here. So, the top first off. It's a crop top with pockets, which I love. And the buttons are snap, so you don't need to stress with putting it through a loop or anything. Just snap to close, easy peasy. I also love the fabric. It's very textured and thick enough for this weather i love the color as well it's in um 
beige color, off-white beige nude dish um, hue. I'm definitely taking this on my staycation. Looks so good on me. Size is an XL. The sleeves are torn up, which is so cute as well. I got this for £30, £29.99. So her just call it £30. Pants, on the other hand, is a chiffon pants in this beautiful burnt orange and uh, the turquoise, turquoise green um prints it's so beautiful but i'm thinking this is more like a beach wear or a swimwear because i'm not really understanding it's very see-through so if you have one undergarment that is not black or nude or the color of the pants it will definitely show it has this skirt and pants combo thing going on i remember having this as a child my dad bought a lot of this type of outfits for me this skirt and Trouser. I had the leggings version so, so this is it and then you just tie it here I believe this was let me check my receipt $49.99 £50 definitely going to return it I'm not a fan it's nice but not for me what do you all think let me know overall my favorite in this fit is the top I really like it I can't even return it because return window is over so but I'm glad I kept it. If I wanted to return it, I'd have returned it from Nigeria. They have a return policy from Nigeria and it's so easy. All you need to do is just print out the return slip and a DHL person comes to pick it up from your location. Next are these two. I got this from Nigeria. I also have the white version of this. I'll leave a picture here of what it looks like. You all already know it. I wore it in Kenya when we went for the YouTube um, Black Voices for its graduation. This I really love, the pink. I got the pink first, right? But I did not like it paired with my black pants. So I quickly ordered a white one because I was going for a particular look and I love how it came out. Yeah, this is the white version. In terms of fabric, the pink is a bit more flimsy while the white is thicker. It's giving that good cotton fabric. I don't know why that is. Probably because different fabrics, different colors, but the same style. Yeah, this one is a bit lighter. I love that it has this mismatch pocket thing going on. It's cropped. It has the sleeves. You can leave it undone or you can button it up. Or I just like to leave it undone when I'm going for casual looks. But when I'm dressing up, I will button it up. This one was for £29.99, £30. Sizing, I will confirm and leave on the screen. I can't remember, but I believe it's either a double XL or an XL. Moving over to this parachute pants. I got it here and it was on sale. This was the cheapest thing I have gotten or one of the cheapest things I've gotten from Zara. I got it for just £9. I really love it. Love the color. This is definitely going to be my travel uniform or on days when I just want to run errands. I love the drawstring um, detail on the bottom area. You can choose to leave it open or tie it like I did now. It has pockets. I would have really loved if it had back pockets but it doesn't. This is what it looks like. It's not tight on me at all. This is in double XL. Like I mentioned, it was on sale for nine pounds. I don't know if you can get this. Probably on the website if you look closely. Yeah, this is what it looks like right together. Definitely not going to pair it like this. Just for the purpose of this video, I wanted to show you what they look like individually, but paired to make it look so I don't come out here with just bra and pants or just top and pants <laughs> on that wear so yeah this is it i love it not going to return the shirt obviously return window has expired pants i'm definitely keeping because i'm feeling it what do you all think let me know but usual if there's anything in this haul that you like and you like to get it from nigeria just hit me up and i got you okay all right just for a small price <laughs> yeah we're almost done with this haul. I just have two more things to show you and we'll call it a day. Final items in this haul are these tees in white and in black. They are $9.99 each. I never run out of basics, hence my getting more because I always love how simple they can look and you can pair them with different things from jackets to blazers. They are very versatile pieces in simple terms. They are definitely my favorite tees. These are high quality t-shirts. If you know Zara, you know that they are mid to high end. I would call it you can't compare the quality that you get from zara to a lot of other fast fashion brands so when i saw this i just wanted to get it and i'm really loving it it doesn't have lint on it it's so soft to the touch and i got this in an xl it's stretchy but not stretchy in a way that after a few hours of wear it will just collapse on your body no this just stays like this and yeah i really like it 
what do y'all think so y'all that's it with this haul let me know your top three in terms of everything i just showed you i know that they are all giving but let me just give you give you the opportunity to tell me <laughs> Subscribe if you are yet to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching leave a comment in the comment section and share this video Do you think Zara is too expensive for the quality of things you get? Let me know your thoughts as well in the comment section And also let me know the next haul that you want me to give you. I've given you Primark. I've given you Zara I've given you pretty little thing or I'm going to give you pretty little things soon I don't know if that one is going to come up before or after this, but just let me know Let me know. Let me know which I hit me up and I'll do it for you Also remember that I can get this stuff for you and ship them to you in Nigeria if you're interested. Alrighty I'll see you all in my next one